for those who may not be familiar, Dr. Welke, can you give a, a bit of a snapshot in, in, into what the curriculum looks like at Wasson? We have what's called an organ systems-based curriculum. Um, we have five terms here at Wasson, and each term there are two courses. All students take the same courses. So it's not like undergraduate where you choose biology 301 and then physics 202 or something like this. Um, so each semester, there's two courses, one which is foundations of medicine and the other is patient-centered care. Within foundations of medicine, there's units. So let's say in second semester, you would take cardiovascular unit, then respiratory unit, and then the renal unit, which they just finished <laughs> successfully. Right. So... And within each of those units, we don't, so we don't have disciplines. We're not teaching anatomy and then physiology and then pharmacology. Within that unit, you would have um, cardiovascular, give me one, valvular disorders or something like valvular disorders. And you have a clinician in there and a physiologist and maybe a pharmacologist. And those three faculty are working together and sort of ping-ponging off each other. And the students are working through questions or cases. There might be a small, like, mini-type didactic talk from the faculty. Um, but really, it's interactive and active, and our classrooms are built around that. So student, we have, we have desks that we can sort of move around, so we can put students in pods, or they can work individually. And so it's really progressive, um, this integrated sort of um, organ system space. The other thing I want to say is it's all patient down. So we realize here, you're coming to medical school because you want to be a physician. I'm not training you to be a PhD in biochemistry. So we we really focus on what do the students need to know within biochemistry or physiology related to this disease or problem in order to solve that case. So we're not throwing hundreds of pages of reading at, at the students or anything. We're, keep, we're saying, here's a patient. How, do, how are we going to solve this puzzle of the patient problem? And then we take it from there. So it's really unique, and, and I think it's really um, dynamic and fun. <laughs> <laughs>